Macular degeneration is a condition that affects the central vision. It is related to the aging of the eye, but genetics also impacts the development of this condition. Because it only affects the central vision, patients do not go completely blind from macular degeneration. It spares the peripheral vision. There are two forms of macular degeneration. The first form is called the dry form of macular degeneration. This is the more common form and about 90% of patients are afflicted with this type. Fortunately, the impact on vision for this patient is very minimal. The wet form of macular degeneration is the second type of, of macular degeneration. In this condition, patients start to become symptomatic, meaning they start to see distortion in their vision or may see some black spots in their central vision. Without treatment, patients usually develop legal blindness. Treatment consists of injection of a medicine into the eye, which is given every month for, for at least two years. Some patients may need more than two years, and some patients may need less than that. I participated as a principal investigator towards the FDA approval of Aflibercept, or ILEA, which is the latest treatment available now for wet macular degeneration. With this drug, there's about a 90% chance that patients with wet macular degeneration can maintain their present vision. Additionally, there is about a 40% chance that the vision may improve by about three lines. Diabetic retinopathy is an eye condition that is one of the complications of being diabetic. It results from the development of abnormal blood vessels on the retina, which is at the back of the eye, causing swelling of the retina, which potentially affects the vision. Unfortunately, it is a potentially blinding disease. So it is very important that patients work with their primary care physician or their medical specialist in order to keep the blood sugar, blood pressure, and cholesterol under good control and to prevent progression or development of diabetic retinopathy. An epiretinal membrane is a cellophane film that could develop on the surface of the retina. It is actually a very common condition and could be seen in about 80% of the population. It impacts the vision by causing distortion and potentially blurring of vision. A macular hole develops as a result of traction of the vitreous jelly on the macula. The macula is the center of the retina, that it consists of specialized cells that allows us to see 2020. Hence, any defect that happens in the macula impacts our vision. Retinal detachment happens when the retina detaches from the back of the eye. Most forms of retinal detachment are caused by abnormal traction of the vitreous jelly on the retina, causing the development of tears through which fluid can get under the retina, causing the retina to separate from the, from the back of the eye. It is a very serious condition that needs attention within hours or a few days in order to prevent permanent blindness.